Hi everybody, welcome to McCallum Bike Pipes. I'm Kenny McLeod. We thought we'd give you a quick look around the factory as it is now, just to let you see the difference between now and what it was pre the virus situation. So here we are in the foyer. We've got all the social distancing measures in place. And uh, if anybody needs anything, masks or anything, we've got all that, we've provided all that as well. For the Highland Dress office, Tom's working in there just now. There's really no orders or anything for Highland Dress, so he's helping in assembly. And then move into our showroom. Normally the showroom would be bustling with pipes and different things in display, but we've really sold everything that we've got in stock. So and it's been used, as you can see, for assembly as well. We do all the dress hire and Highland Dress sales from here as well. This is Ian Plunkett. Some of you all know him. He was the pipe leader of Strathclyde Police from 1997-2002. Retired from the police now and he works for McCallum Bag Pipes part time. So we're going to move through into the factory and this is Stuart McCallum. So he'll talk you through all the different processes that we make. Hi, welcome to McCallum's. If you want to follow me, we'll have a wee quick tour of the factory. for African Blackwood it comes to us in a 14 piece set and it is the very very early stages of what we do. First operations, we'll turn the wood to the ground, put it through, set the same machines, turn it down, pour it up. So it's a 14 piece set. We turn it down, pour it up, and we set it aside for about 12 weeks to let it stabilise the wood before we take on to the next process. CMC machine just still needs a very basic rust profile just to let the wood dry out and breathe. Simple operation, just turn in and put it up for the fairies to be fitted. Put the small pipe parts and big pipe parts and fairies. Sean here, he's doing all the, the, the corner and feeding, it's all done by hand. Everything's made in-house, we call it in-house, and then it'll go to another part of the bank to be engraved. And the bells are piper with peel please. This is a part of a universal blow pipe ball joint ball stick. Uh, practice chances getting drilled. It's a poly pipes, just at the early stages, first operation, we're just turning and threading, and it will end up as a 10 or 1 joint. And you see the imitation ivory mounts get screwed in place. Over here, a bit of a poly pipe. You see, practice 
Santa tops. What are they saying? Think I'm seeing something. Magazine bar feed machine, it's making the ferals, turning them, threading them. Imitation ivory mouthpiece bulb. of a water trap system is a two-piece split stop. It's the first operation, we're just drilling the holes in the centre. The only will come this way, we can use the other one. This is John John, what's on the island pipes? This is some of the... Drones. Is Emma Stewart's daughter? And Jackie, Jackie Leask, mother of famous piper Stevie Leask. <laughs> this is where all the new products start off. This one I'm working on here, this is a, a new plastic blowpipe. So I'll allow you to see it simulated. This is before it goes the programs written before it goes out to the, the machines. It's a handy tool just to make sure there's no collisions or anything going to go wrong. It gives you a, a, a feel for how the product's going to going to it's going to finish up. That's great. Thanks, Stuart. We'll just have a quick wander up to Rory of MG Reads as well. And 
Dat is iets van niks te zullen. <coughs> See, we've got a lot of blackwoods in stock. That was really to do with Brexit rather than the virus situation. We ordered an awful lot of extra wood because we weren't quite sure uh, if the wood comes from a, a supplier in Germany, so we weren't sure if we would be able to get it. So we're very overstocked with blackwood at the moment. It's not a bad thing. These are all the acetyl pipes that we make. This is MG Reach. Rory Grosser. Oh. Piper within the Rary and District, world champion at the moment. Hi. So he makes all the Kane Brun reads that. In the really play in here. There's just trying to read some synthetic drone as well that go in all the pipes. So, so thanks Rory. We'll head into the small pipes. Thanks. Yeah. This is where all the small pipes are assembled and tested. This is Scott Figgins, very good young piper, plays for shots and dykehead. And that's all the sets of pipes there, just ready to get bags fitted and bellows, what's the word needing is done, done to them. All the bellows are made in here from scratch. It's a newly style bellow we put on, so it's a double skin and very, very inefficient. Thanks, Scott. Thank you. Just have a quick look through assembly and then that'll be the end of the tour for sure. This is assembly where everything's put together before shipping all over the world or collected as it needs to be in Scotland. It's Richard and Gavin, two pipers. Stevie just so going into the office, he's a drummer. So we can let drummers work here as well. And then we'll go back to the showroom. And here we are back at the front door, so I hope you've enjoyed that short tour of how things are at the moment at McCallum Bagpipes. Thank you.